Hello, I'm Dr. Inman, and this is Star, and this is probably one of the most important videos I'm going to have in this series. This is a video about anterior cruciate ligament rupture repair. One of the main reasons that people don't purchase other lasers or other techniques is because the cost, the cost of a laser essentially has been fifteen to twenty thousand dollars in the past. Now it's down to six thousand to seven thousand dollars. If this device costs fifty bucks, you'd have like ten of them in your practice essentially. So one of the most common reasons that people don't purchase a laser is because of the cost of the equipment, and I appreciate that. However, cost return becomes really important, and we're going to talk a little bit about anterior cruciate ligament rupture repair. Last year, Americans spent two point two billion dollars in the veterinary surgery involving fixing anterior cruciate ligament repair. 2.2 billion dollars. We have been repairing this condition and by the way uh, I've made a living for years and years and years doing that surgery. The success rate for that surgery is about a hundred percent or at least anywhere above 97 percent essentially and there's a number of different techniques that are out there that are using and some of the recent techniques involving anterior cruciate repair involving replaning the dorsal aspect of the tibial plateau have been called in question lately because they're not necessarily that much more effective but they're a lot more expensive than the other techniques that have been out there that have been successful um, and I've done all of them. Um, Any more what we'll do is we'll endeavor to fix these animals by actually addressing the underlying problem. The chances that a surgery that's cost anywhere from four thousand to seven thousand dollars per knee is going to have to be repeated again eight or nine months according to the American College of Veterinary Surgeons is sixty to eighty percent. In other words, if we do a surgical repair, we'll fix that leg and then the other leg blows out within the next year and this is a very common condition. When we would utilize and go the underlying problem which is actually fixing the L4-5 subluxation neurological interference that causes that condition, we end up invariably uh, with a recurrence level on the, le on the other leg as 3%. So that's significantly different, indicating the primary problem is an unbalanced quadriceps held in place by the the uh, lower lumbar uh, subluxation phenomenon. And so that is actually the solution to this problem. And so when we would use this device, we'd have about a 70% chance of resolving the problem without surgery. When we use this device, and also what we'd use is a frequency specific laser. Some of you have this device. And we would basically then take and laser these animals along this area around and go after the knee in this regard and do this approach. And the success rate for that rose to combination of these two approaches to about 95%, 90% for sure. And so that became a reason for us to actually abandon most of our surgeries. Now, the important thing is that we'll know if, we, if this and this basically solves a problem in two to three weeks. If it doesn't, we can always go to surgery, and that's essentially the approach that we use. Anymore, however, we'll utilize this particular instrument. And this instrument basically allows us to deliver instead of four sets that we have to program four times of four, in other words, 16 frequencies. We'll flip this guy on. Comes on, we put in the passcode two, three, four, enter it, and comes up standard hood. We come down here, and I have it set because last time I did it as anterior cruciate ligament. We hit that button, it tells me to put on the glasses, which I won't do, and then we're lasering. And so the therapy involves starlight down like a dead dog. Okay, good dog, good doggy. And so this is the this is the therapy right here. So we'll go ahead and laser this dog like this. And this is the therapy that we use to take care of it. It'll go for about a minute to two minutes. It's delivering 16 different frequencies. I can rattle them off. You've used them before, essentially. But lasering them uh, uh, in, in two-second intervals has become, in one particular setting, has become more and more effective also. The frequency sets that we use are, are improved and expanded, and they're nowhere printed on the Internet because of copyright, um, uh, copyright laws. So essentially, well, they are magically in this device along with 1,800 different frequency sets that allows us to take care of this. Now notice that we're getting this whole area, and I told you the condition actually occurs in the lower back. The frequency sets that we're using here will also in fact the lower back, and by the way, Star is snoring right now for crying out loud. And so we'll go ahead and laser this dog. Now, what we're able to do with a combination like this is about 90% of these animals we're able to treat. And if you're sending this disease condition down the street for a boarded surgeon to take care of because you don't do the surgery anymore, you're probably losing that client, according to the American College or American Animal Hospital Association. By the way, these applications are also applicable to the human knee, and I've treated several and, uh, with good success. There's also lots of other frequency sets that will handle knee uh, inflammation. Um, in this particular device. Remember there are 900, it's okay, honey, 900 frequency sets specifically for human beings.
in this particular device also, which is why we like it. This particular uh, instrument will turn off and is set to turn off in two minutes and then we'll be uh, done with this particular lasering. But I mentioned to you that the uh, return on investment for this device just using anterior cruciate ligament rupture repair is essentially so significant that if I was to give you the numbers, you wouldn't believe me. Nobody ever does until they actually apply it in their practice. I would, rec I would recommend that you consider this and go back to the webpage that you probably came to, came to this video from and realize that you can go to the website uh, which is vomtech.com forward slash laser forward slash home and basically address uh, more information about this instrument or you can call me at area code 208-640-3430 um, if you have questions about in, uh, uh, latching on to one of these devices essentially I sell them uh, I don't sell them they're sold from the manufacturer with my frequency sets in them I just order them for you I appreciate your patience and I cannot express to you how more uh, um, vehemently how in fact valuable it is to use this instrument on this disease condition first. Remember, if this doesn't work after two or three weeks, the owner has spent maybe a couple hundred dollars maximum and then we can always go to surgery. Thank you. Have a great day.